Here we go, brownies. Here we go. Hey. Here we go, brownies. Here we go. Man, our director. That's what you should have said. That's where the guy I'm going. A beast, to say the least, Miles Garrett is an absolute monster on the field and is every offensive lineman's worst nightmare. It's unlikely that you haven't at least heard of Miles Garrett, all pro defensive end for the Cleveland Browns. His ability to get the edge, push the pocket, and be a terror all over the field has landed him the number 11 spot on the 2022 Top 100 NFL Players list. Let's start this video off with a look at his vital stats and family life. Often dubbed as Flash, the outstanding athlete was born Miles Lorenz Garrett on December 29, 1995 in Arlington, Texas, United States. Son of Audrey and Lawrence Garrett, Miles Garrett, now 26, is a Capricorn for all of you astrology folks out there. He stands six feet, four inches tall and weighs a staggering 275 pounds. He also runs a 4.6 40-yard dash and has even been clocked in the 4.5s. At his size, well, that's just scary. As you might have guessed, the entire Garrett family is full of phenomenal athletes. His mother was an All-American track star at Hampton University. His older sister, Bria Garrett, was also an incredible track and field at Texas A&M, where she won the 2014 NCAA title in the 20-pound weight throw, becoming the first weight throw champion in Aggie history. Last but not least, Miles' half-brother, Sean Williams, played college ball at Boston College and was picked 17th by the New Jersey Nets in the 2007 NBA Draft. Talking of Garrett's education, he attended James Martin High School in Arlington, Texas, where he was a three-sport athlete for the Warriors, lettering in football, basketball, and track. Here's a pretty interesting fact. So, Miles never even played football until he got to high school. The athletic director at the time pretty much told Miles, if you're gonna play basketball, you gotta play football. He started off as a wide receiver, but after a few defensive linemen went down, his coaches said, please try defensive end. And yeah, as we all know now, the rest is history. Garrett claimed several high school honors, including Parade All-American, All-SEC, Max Preps All-American, and Texas Class 5A Defensive Player of the Year. As you can imagine, Miles had plenty of offers coming out of college, but chose to follow his older sister Bria to College Station to play for the Texas A&M Aggies. On to his college career and achievements. He had quite the college career for the Aggies, including leading the team in sacks his freshman year and leading the SEC in sacks in sophomore year, and was also selected as a finalist for awards like the Rotary Lombardi, Bednarik, and Ted Hendricks. He was also the Bill Willis Award winner as the top defensive lineman. The season resulted in Garrett earning a unanimous consensus All-American designation. Later, he would go on to complete his education at Texas A&M University with a bachelor's degree in global arts, planning, design, and construction. He also holds a minor in geology and business administration. Now, before we move on to Miles' NFL career, if you've learned anything at all so far, please consider dropping a like on this video and consider subscribing. It really helps our channel grow and allows more NFL fans just like you to learn more about their favorite players. Thank you for your support. Okay, off to the dog pound. Let's take a look at Miles' NFL career. On December 31st, 2016, Garrett officially declared for the 2017 NFL Draft and was the first overall pick by the Cleveland Browns, becoming the highest draft pick from Texas A&M in history. The young defensive end started his career on Sundays off strong with recording 13.5 sacks in his rookie campaign. He was named to the PFWA All-Rookie Team for his performance. In his second year in the league, he was named a defensive captain and he was a pro bowler in 2018, 2020, and 2021. He was also second team all pro in 2018 and first team all pro in 2020 and 2021. I'd be shocked if he wasn't a pro bowler this year as well. Now for a little bit of drama. The NFL suspended Garrett indefinitely for ripping Mason Rudolph's helmet off and hitting him in the head with it during the Browns 21-7 win on November 14, 2019. The brawl was sparked, according to Garrett, when Rudolph called him a racial slur. The incident ended up costing him the final six games of the regular season and roughly $1.2 million in pay. 
plus a fine of over $45,000. A brief look now at his recent contract and endorsement deals. Garrett first signed a four-year contract in 2017 worth $30 million, including a signing bonus of $20.3 million with the Cleveland Browns. On the field, he's been everything the Browns had hoped when they made him the first overall pick and when they gave him this huge contract extension. But this is just the beginning. In 2020, the defensive end signed a $125 million contract extension, including a $21 million signing bonus and $43 million guaranteed at signing and $100 million total guaranteed over the length of the four-year contract netting him an average annual salary of $25 million. This is why we call him Big Money Miles. Garrett's also signed various endorsement deals with famous brands in the past few years like Waiakea, Pepsi, and Aquafina. His biggest contract of all used to be with Adidas, but he just recently left and signed a multi-year endorsement deal with another sports apparel giant, Reebok, which Reebok is extremely excited about, and rightfully so. So, how does he spend his lots? Well, unlike some of the previous players we've covered who are a little bit more frugal, Miles is not one to not fall out. He likes to spend the money he's earned on extravagant houses, cars, and other luxuries to take his life off the field to another level. His lavish house in Wadsworth, Ohio is quite large and in one of the nicest areas of Ohio. This home was in the news during the last Halloween season for its decoration with tombstones of rival quarterbacks. His favorite of his many cars is his McLaren 765LT that comes with a twin turbocharged 4.0 liter V8 that cranks out 755 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque with an MSRP of $380,000. Peaking now into his personal life, Garrett nowadays is in a happy relationship with his girlfriend Sarah Tume, a former soccer player. It's evident that they're head over heels in love with each other as the two often post pictures and videos featuring one another on social media, and they look totally adorable together. Sarah's now running a nutrition company and was a performance nutritionist intern with the Browns for seven months, which is where the couple are said to have met. The Browns defensive end was first spotted on Sarah's social media account in July 2019, but the couple did not disclose their relationship until March of 2020. Now, let's check out what Miles Garrett does for philanthropy and charitable work. Being involved in many charitable efforts and social justice projects, Garrett's been impressive off the field as well. He serves as a community ambassador for United Way of Greater Cleveland. Additionally, the Chris Long Foundation has nominated Miles Garrett as the captain of the NFL Waterboys program. Their mission is to bring clean water to East African communities. Involved directly with the Water Boys organization, Garrett is leading a group of players to engage fans in an effort to provide water to one million people, where his Tackle Thirst campaign has donated money for every sack he made last season. According to the Water Boys official site, the program has served 480,000 people so far. He's also partnered with the Cleveland Hope Exchange and local businesses to provide more than 24,000 pounds of food and additional resources to those in need. Garrett also participated in a charity Twitch stream alongside Denzel Ward to benefit the World Health Organization's COVID-19 Solidarity Response Fund. He's joined hands with the Alzheimer's Association as well. Now, at this point, you must be getting excited about his net worth. Garrett's $100 million guaranteed remains the most of any defensive player the league has ever seen. And according to the sources, his net worth is somewhere between $25 and $50 million at this point. But that is surely to climb way higher as he finishes out his four-year contract in Cleveland. That's it for now, guys. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye and peace out.